let's go ahead and get started. Um, hello, everyone. I think everybody that's uh, logged on here is a member, so they probably know me. Um, but I'm Kim Colby, and uh, if you look in the Brady Bunch screen over um, in your gallery, you will see me. Um, I know this is new for a lot of people, and some of you are really becoming to be old hand at it. So congratulations. We just keep learning, don't we? Um, I'm going to start by introducing the very lovely and talented Katie Anderson. And Katie has on her boyfriend's headphones today. <laughs> very Katie, cool looking. Yes, yeah, very cool. Katie is our social media manager, and she has done a fabulous job um, redesigning the website, and it's beautiful, and it's much more user-friendly, and uh, personally, I love it. Um, so I wanted to go ahead and let her start by kind of walking us through the, the new website and, and how to navigate that. Um, and then later on, I will take it over and we'll talk more about our online accounts and what you can do online in your own personal Seniors on the Move account. Perfect. Well, yeah, thanks, Kim. Um, again, I'm Katie. Uh, you might see my cat make an appearance. He's snoozing behind my computer at the moment, but he does like to make an appearance sometimes. So if you see an orange kitty, nothing to worry about. So as Kim said, uh, we went ahead and redesigned the website, wanted to make it a bit easier for everybody to see um, and to navigate through. And plus we added some fun little things that we'll be showing you, which I hope you find as exciting as I do. So can everybody see my screen here where it says Seniors in the Move right at the top? Perfect. So let me see, let me move this window here so this isn't in my way. So uh, this is the home page, and this is where you land when you enter the Seniors on the Move site. And our address up here is seniorsonthemove-ia for iowa.com. And that's how you can find this site. Um, you can also do a Google search for it. It should definitely come up, but if you want to go directly to the site, uh, www.seniorsonthemove-ia.com. And this is where you will land. So there's a lot of content on this page, which we will go through. Um, but I just want to start by letting everyone know up at the top, um, this is like the top bar that you'll find on just about every page. And the login for you to log into your specific Seniors in the Move account is in the upper right. Hello, new joiner. Um, so this button here, when you click this little guy, that is a representation of you and your profile. It says login. So if you click on that, it will take you here where you can enter your email and password and log into your Seniors in the Move account. So if you want to um, say sign up for an event or anything like that, that's where you'd find it. It's always gonna be up here in the upper right hand corner. And now to go back to the homepage, I'm just gonna click our logo right there in the center and it will take us back. And that's a behavior that will happen on, on every page. So you can always click the logo to go back to home or you can click home right here. Also in the top, we've got a little search bar if you want to manually enter anything. Enter search string is just a fancy website way of saying enter what you want to search for. So you could search for testimonials or you could search for a photo gallery or anything like that. And that's how it will help you. And then also right here below, we've got our social media links. So if you haven't yet followed us on Facebook um, and you use Facebook, go ahead and do that. You can click any of these buttons to take you to the social media sites. The first one on the left here is, of course, Facebook with the F. We don't use Twitter a lot, but if you have a Twitter and would like to follow us, you can click this button here with the little bird on it. IN is our LinkedIn profile. That's more for business stuff, but if you use LinkedIn, go ahead and follow us. And then finally here, this red one is YouTube. And that's something we recently added. We have a lot of great videos about testimonials um, and past events and things like that. So if you want to browse those videos, you can follow by clicking this red button here. So that's the top bar. Um, it's going to be very similar on the other pages. So just to let you know if you ever need to go back home, just click that little center button there. So let's go ahead and look at what's on the home page. So we wanted to make sure that the home page kind of lets everybody know about what Seniors in the Move is about. So if you're familiar with our organization, you're already going to know these things, you know, you've already been on a trip, you know how this goes, but maybe you want to show um, a friend or a family member about um, this organization that you're a part of. This will be a good way to get them acquainted. 
So we've got uh, life moves move with it, which I think is a really wonderful tagline and explains what we do. And on this page, there's a lot of buttons that will take you to different parts of the website, like this button here will take you to testimonials where you can read lovely things about um, our trips. Learning about membership will take you to the membership page. We're gonna go through these pages individually. We just wanted to take you down the page here as we go. We got some beautiful smiling people talking about travel, mingling and exploring, which I think that we all enjoy. Here are the buttons. You can view the events calendar or go to the photo gallery. Um, and then if this isn't the cleanest, most pristine dentist office that I've ever seen, what a, I, would, I would go get my teeth cleaned all the time. If this is what it looked like, you know, so relaxing. Just a reminder that being a Seniors in the Move member gets you access to those affordable dental plans and vision plans. That's what this little blurb is about. And you can also access those by these buttons here. Um, and then we're gonna talk uh, as it scrolls, we will get into the affiliate section. Sorry, it was just loading there quick. And if you haven't been on the new website or haven't encountered this section on the previous website, every week we're gonna be featuring an affiliate. Um, you can always read their feature story with this button here. So this week um, it's hearing Dr. of Central Iowa and Dr. Jessica Dimmick. So if you wanna read more about her or what they do, what Hearing Doctors of Iowa does, clicking the button to read the feature story will let you do that. And then you are all probably familiar with our affiliates here, but this is just gonna go through the affiliate ads um, on the homepage. And finally at the bottom, more smiling, happy people and a link to join. And then one more thing, uh, this is called the footer at the bottom. You don't have to know that it's called a footer, but there's other helpful links down here too. So we've got the Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and YouTube as well. And then if you ever need to know our address and you can't remember it or you need access to the phone number, that's always gonna live down here at the very bottom. So you can always find that information. Okay. So I'm gonna scroll back up to the top here and we're gonna go to the first, um, this is called the navigation bar. So this little blue bar here. So if you're ever, you don't know where you are on the website or you need to know where to go, this is gonna give you just a great idea of what the options are um, and where you can navigate to. So we're gonna to go to the first one that's about us and we're gonna to go to the welcome section. And do you guys recognize this person? Hopefully. That's our lovely Kim. So this is a bit about, um, you know, Kim's reason why um, she founded Seniors on the Move. There's a lot of wonderful things she has to stay here. And this is a great way to, again, if someone is new to Seniors on the Move, wants to know more about it, you know, the mission behind it, what we're here for, this is going to explain to everyone. Um, and I like this. You can count on us to offer a hand and a smile as you make the most of every day. So that's what we're here to do. And again, if you want to share this with someone, a great way to do that. And then here there's a button as well to learn more about membership. That just makes it easy to, to find everything that you might want to know about the organization itself. So I'm gonna go ahead and hover my mouse over this section here. So we were just in welcome and now we're gonna go to staff. And you might not need to reference the staff page, but if you said, hey, I just wanna look at all of these beautiful people that are helping the seniors in the move, we got you covered. Um, so you're going to see some familiar faces, Kim, Nancy, Lisa, and then you've got me at the bottom here. And then our email addresses are listed here as well. If you ever wanted to contact us individually, you can click that and it's going to open in your email application of choice on your computer and let you send a message to us. So um, say you find something on the website that you super hate and you want to tell me about it, you can send me an email and I'd be glad to read it. So that's just a fun little page that tells everybody, you know, who's behind this, what we look like, things like that. So again, under about us, oops, I accidentally clicked. I didn't mean to click. I'm going to hover once it, once it settles here. Okay. And then the third item here is the newsletter. So I'm assuming most of you have read a newsletter before. Maybe you got it in the mail. Maybe you got it via email. This is a way where you can sign up to receive the newsletter if that's not something that you're getting. We can send it to you electronically um, and you can also view past newsletters here as well with these buttons. This button will take you to the September newsletter and this button takes you to the most recent one. And then um, 
all you need to do to sign up to receive this newsletter. And Kim, I can't remember yesterday, did we say that all members need to sign up if they want to receive it electronically? Um, yes, they do. Because okay. I've been just, uh, because I've only been sending physical newsletters um, recently to people that do not have email. Uh, okay. And I, I, yeah, I think that's probably a, a good idea. A good okay. Idea. Just to go ahead so we can get everybody on the list, just to make sure we're not sending you something that you don't want. Okay, perfect. So if you click here in this little field, um, that's my email address and I can put it in there or I can type it in. This little thing called a recaptcha or a captcha, you just have to select the box that says you're not a robot. Um, and it's probably gonna have you do something like this. Select the squares that are a motorcycle. So I would select the squares that look like they have a motorcycle and I'd click verify. And that should be able to push me through if I were to enter my email address. So let me just enter this and click subscribe. And it says here, this nice little green banner, your information was submitted, thank you. So we know that the information has been put in there. And then um, after that happens, you'll receive email communication about great upcoming events. And then those newsletters, which are sent out about every three months. So if that's something you'd like to receive to your email inbox, you can go ahead and sign up on that page. And again, if you ever just want to come and look at those newsletters, say you have a friend that wants to, you know, see the most recent one, uh, click this button here for January. It will open up a new tab and it's loading now. January 2021 newsletter, load, load, load. And here it is all these four pages. Um, there's some great articles in here, some nice quotes, information about the new day trippers club, upcoming events, things like that. So um, again, a great thing to share with other people or if you didn't get your newsletter and want to see it, that's where you can find it. And you can also print it from there too. Yes, yep, print, download. Um, yeah, it's a great idea. Then you can just read it anytime you want. Because sometimes it's a lot looking at a screen for a long time. Good old fashioned printing and reading, a little bit easier on the eyes. Uh, okay, let's see, make sure we did all those things. I got my little list here. So I'm making sure we're, we're staying on track. <laughs> uh, so this is a new part of the website. So if you visited this site before, you might not have seen it. This is just something I added, but we're very excited about Senior Retreat Day. Uh, it happens every year. This year is gonna be the fifth annual. And if you want to learn about Senior Retreat Day, if you click this area here, it's just gonna take you to the general page and it wants to know if you want information about the conference or if you want information about becoming a sponsor. Um, for this purpose, I'm gonna go ahead and click into the conference information, which is this button here. You can also find that hovering and then conference information. And there's not a lot that we have for this page yet, just because we're still, you know, figuring out those speakers, um, figuring out the layout, all the vendors, things like that. But this is where that information will be populated when you want to keep up on, um, on these things going towards June 2nd. So mark your calendars, June 2nd, Senior Retreat Day. And also, um, that's where they'll find the registration link once Perfect. we get the itinerary um, ready to go and start marketing it, which should be very soon. Um, and then uh, just an FYI, as most of the members know, uh, your attendance at Senior Retreat Day is uh, part of your membership. So you will get to um, come to that complimentary, come free. Um, we do ask that if you say you're going to attend, that you do actually attend because we have to pay for your meals and that type of thing. Um, we'll also be doing a little bit of a, um, we'll be doing a promotion uh, where we're going to give out some extra day tripper miles for members that bring guests. And if you're a member of the day tripper club, you'll get even more miles than everyone else. So mm -hmm. extra bonus. <laughs> so uh, keep your eyes out for that promotion. It'll all be coming out real soon, hopefully in the next two weeks. All right. So on this page right now, um, you can find the date, the time that it's going to happen and the location. If you came last year, it's at the same location at the Sheraton West Des Moines Hotel. What a beautiful location. I just loved that lunch in the big open atrium with the waterfall last year. Just beautiful and a really good luncheon too. 
So again, right here, more information about 2021's event is coming soon, like Kim said. But if you want to watch a video about last year's um, last year's event or view any pictures, these are here. So I will show you how to navigate through these photo galleries. It seems pretty self-explanatory, but just in case. On the bottom, there's always going to be one of these scrolly bars that you can click and drag. And it will drag through the photos we have. It's a great way to navigate through. Or if you see one picture that you like, say this smiling one here, a vintage cooperative, you can click it open. And then these arrows on the side are going to navigate you through and back through the photos. So if you want to see them bigger, you can click one and then go through arrows. And then when you want to get rid of this screen, the little X at the top will take you out of it. Perfect. And now, Kim, um, would you like me to play this video here? I'm just wondering if I need to take out my headphones or if it will just play through. Let me see. Yeah, go ahead. I think it'll play. I'll tell Can you, you hear the music? Nope. Nope. Okay. But let's try this instead. Can you hear that music? That was a little bit about last year's event. Kim, what were you saying when it was playing? I couldn't hear you. I was just saying that um, all the, the videos, like if you're watching videos, they're housed on the YouTube channel. Yes, they are. And just to make that bigger, I click this little button here when you hover it over, hover over, kind of wants to jump out at you like that. That just means it's going to go to full screen. So if you wanted to view the video bigger, that's the button that works. Um, but if you want to share a video, this little arrow button up here, when you click share, it will ask you if you want to copy the link to copy and paste or say you want to share it on Facebook. Um, that's a great way to just grab that video and share it somewhere. Yeah, and we love it when you share. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna go back up here. Um, and I don't know if any of you here now are wanting to sponsor Senior Retreat Day, but say you know someone that might want to or might want to be a vendor. This page here that says sponsors and vendors is going to give anyone um, the information they need to make the decision about um, creating a sponsorship package. So again, kind of similar to the other page, a little bit of information. And then there's um, the vendor showcase pricing and what that gets you. You can download the prospectus um, or register online, as well as being a VIP sponsor. So if you have someone that has um, a business and they want to, you know, reach the senior community. Maybe you've been to this event before, you know how great it is and you want to share that with them. Uh, this is a page to send them to. And again, there's the video and the pictures at the bottom as well. Oh, hey, Nancy. We can finally see Nancy. <laughs> okay. So senior retreat day, more information is going to be there as we get more information and then, um, yeah, if you're a member, you can attend for free, which is awesome. And registration link will be there very soon. So I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the membership tab here. As you can see, there's a lot of stuff under membership and this is just all the great things that you know either come with membership or can be added on. 
So the top one, just about member benefits, is where we're going to go first. And honestly, I don't think I need those headphones. I'm, I feel like I'm just fine without them. They're very cool looking. They make me feel more official, but I don't think I need them. Okay. So um, a lot of you may already know about the member benefits. If you are a member or you know someone that is, but this is just going to kind of give you a nice, concise explanation of what comes with membership. So discounted trips and events, You've got free monthly lunch and learns, discounted day trip or tours, and members always receive special pricing, which is awesome. Here's a link that where you can view our events calendar for signing up for those events. Or if you want more information about our brand new uh, Day Trippers Club for 2021, we'll talk about that in a little bit, but that's where you can find information about that. Scrolling down here a little bit more, um, I love saving money. I'm assuming everybody else does. Uh, so just a little bit more information about how you can save on lots of different things as a member. And this button here will take you to our affiliate network where you can see those special pricings and savings for members, as well as all of those resources that we have for you too. Um, again, about dental and vision coverage, just about how little members can pay for those coverages here. Um, 3278 monthly for dental, and 738 for vision. Great value offered to you as a member. And if you want more information about those plans, you can click vision or dental here. Um, lifeline screenings is another great one. We are gonna go into each of these individually, um, but knowing your risk for stroke and heart disease, getting those screenings at a discounted rate, another great perk of membership. You can learn more about those. And then if you haven't taken advantage of a personal, personalized lifestyle plan, that's a great thing to do as well. Um, a custom tailored plan to meet your needs, depending on you know, where your future trajectory goes, you know, what help you need with that. So we can help with that as well. And you can learn more about that here. So again, just kind of an overview of the membership benefits. So we're gonna go through each of those areas. If you've already joined, the join now page might not be super important for you, but maybe it will be for a friend that you want to have join. So becoming a member is super easy. You can do it online or you can print the form and send it in. Um, but when you do join, you get a new member kit, which gets you that personalized lifestyle plan that I was just talking about, information about lots of upcoming trips, which I think might be the best part about the membership, um, information about our affiliates and resources, and then some goodies. Who doesn't love fun merch and goodies? So if you want to read those terms and conditions, they're a little bit boring, but they're here for your reference if you need them. And then the two ways to apply. You've got apply online. And I'm scrolling here, it's catching up. And then apply by mail. So applying online is super easy, um, but if you do want to do it the old fashioned way, this button is going to get you to download that paper application where you can then print and send it in. And then this is our lovely address where you would send it to if you were to print it off. But if you would want to sign up online, this little form is going to take you through that. And Kim, do you want me to go through this as like a mock membership or would you just like to just um, I think since everybody's already a member, we probably don't need to do that. Okay, cool. But yeah, if you have a friend or a family member that might want to join, they can select their membership level with these little buttons on the side here. Click next, and that's read into your payment information, your personal information, and then that's all stored securely with us. You don't have to worry about that getting anywhere else on the internet. So with membership as well, under this tab, we're gonna go to Day Trippers Club. That's the next part here. So this is a brand new thing for 2021. Um, and at our trip rollout in, what, November? Talked about this a little bit more in depth, um, but if you miss that, this is a great opportunity to learn about what it is. If you're traveling with us multiple times a year, this is a great way to save some extra money. Um, so there's always gonna be a member price, a non-member price, and then there's a special day trippers club, which is even more discounted. So if you're traveling a lot, this is a great thing to take advantage of. You get lowest registration fees available, like I just said trip assurance so you can cancel you know, at the last minute and not have any sort of fee penalty. Um, and then you can earn miles to redeem for merchandise and um, only $125 for the year. And so uh, I think that if you're traveling what more than three trips or something like that, it ends up being a great value and pays for itself three or four trips. So a new thing for 2021. 
yeah, the trip assurance is definitely a, a huge value there. Yeah. Um, and not having any cancellation fees because, you know, if you're traveling with us a lot, obviously, you know, things happen and we realize that too. Um, so this, this would help you out a lot. And uh, one of the things about the day tripper miles that you can earn, um, just an FYI, uh, we will be rolling that out and I've got the orders placed. And so this is the area where you will likely see the um, seniors on the move store where you'll find merchandise and apparel that you can either purchase or um, redeem your miles for and those miles can um, also be redeemed on um, money off of trips or events as well. Do you want to give them a little preview of what merch might be available or is that still hush hush? No no it's a surprise. Okay okay <laughs> it's going to be really cool I feel like we can say that but that's about it. Okay, um, so Day Trips Club information is there. We're gonna go back up to membership, um, dental and vision. Both of these pages kind of look similar and they're gonna be more so if you're not taking advantage of this plan, but if it's not something that you're utilizing and wanna learn more about it. On each of these pages, you'll be able to download the benefit summary if you wanna print it out or use it that way. You're gonna see information about the rates and then just what those things cover. Um, so I'm not going to go through all of this with you, but this information is here if you need it. And then same with the vision page, it's going to look pretty similar. So you'll click through here. I just love this picture of the glasses. Maybe it's because I'm a glasses wearer, but, and I have like 10 pairs of glasses, but I just think this picture is so nice. That's my favorite part of going to the optometrist is looking at the glasses. So again, downloading the summary here, or you can read all the information about pricing um, and what covered the services are covered and what those benefits look like. So all that information is always there for you if you want to reference it or if you want to share it with someone else. And Lifeline Screening is one, um, another membership benefit that I don't know a whole lot about, but seems, seems like a great value and a great preventative and a way to just learn more about your health, you know, and what that means. So lifeline screening is going to help you know your risk for stroke and heart disease. You get four screenings at a low price of $135. Um, I know that I will mispronounce these screenings if I try to say all of them. Um, but you've got these four here, just kind of an explanation of what each of those screenings are, what they can do for you. Um, here's the source code and the number to call to schedule if you are a member and have um, want to take advantage of that information is there. And then there is a really nice detailed brochure. If you click here, I'll just show you, it'll open in a new page as well. And this is going to give you much more information, um, Q and A's about this stuff. So if you have a lot of questions about it, this information is here for you to use. Okay. And then just an FYI, um, another one of our great benefits is Legal Shield and Identity Theft ID Shield. Um, we don't have that page and link up right now. We're trying to um, get that built so that it will go directly to a site where you can apply online. Right now, um, it's paper applications that we process only. And so we're working to change that so that we can get that great pricing for um, products like ID Shield. Um, uh, into the website as well. Awesome. Yeah, another great perk. And um, then I just went to the last page here, personalized lifestyle plans. Um, if you or someone you know is interested in this, this is going to talk about what that initial planning session looks like, what you get out of it, and how custom tailored it is. So it's not a one size fits all plan. It's going to take into account um, everything that's going on in your life and how seniors in the move can best help you. And Kim and Nancy are super great. They love to listen to and, and provide help. You guys are wonderful. Um, that's not something that I do. So do you guys have any comments about the lifestyle plan section? No, it's just, um, it's more informal. We do have a worksheet that we can walk through with people, um, but it is just more informal and we can talk about, you know, where you want to be and um, who we might recommend to, um, help you along the way. Uh, and, and a lot of times, you know, what we'll have is um, some good uh, recommendations in our own um, affiliate referral network, 
or sometimes it's outside of the network. It really just depends on what you're looking for. Um, and, you know, sometimes it's just like, hey, I really need this or and we might say, OK, well, you should come out and travel with us or maybe um, you know, sadly, you just lost a spouse and, you know, you're just needing to get out and socialize more, make some new friends. I mean, just whatever it is, you want to talk to us, um, both Nancy and I are here for you and we will listen and um, keep things confidential. So just feel free to reach out anytime. Sometimes right now, I don't know about you guys, but I'm feeling a little isolated mm -hmm. more than more often than not sometimes. So having someone to lend a listening ear, I think is super important. And if you don't have a support network at home, we're here for you, which is great. All right, I'm gonna move on from this little membership tab. We're gonna go into affiliates and I'm gonna go into the first area, which is the affiliate directory. And a lot of you have met our affiliates, you know, at Lunch and Learns or um, from any you know, services or resources that you've taken advantage of. But the list of affiliates and all of their information is here when you need it. A little bit about what the affiliate network does. And then if you scroll down here, you can see all of our affiliates listed alphabetically by organization. So you've got things like you know, moving services, you've got dental services, you've got fitness and health services. Um, those are all here. If you click into one, Let's say so. Concept by Iowa Hearing, they're our next lunch and learn, right? In March. Perfect. So we're going to go ahead and let's click into this. Say so you want to learn a bit more about them before the lunch and learn. You can see some general information about them, and you can even send a message to that affiliate here by clicking this button. So if you wanted some information to go directly to Concept by Iowa Hearing to Dr. Eric, um, that send message button will take you there. And that's true for any of the affiliates listed. So I'm gonna click the back button on my browser here just to go back to that page we were on. But again, you can go to any of these pages here um, to learn more or to send them a message really easily. And the one thing I do wanna highlight is this affiliate directory where it clicks download. It will open up in another page similar to the you know brochures and um, the membership information we looked at earlier. But this is a great one that can be printed off, you know, hang it up wherever you, um, you know, list your resources. Uh, this is something you're using a lot. And it's also a great thing to share with, um, with people that might need these services as well. And these are nicely organized by category. So financial services, health and wellness services, home help, insurance of many kinds, relocation services. So, you know, moving, changing where you're living, things like that. Um, and then senior housing communities at the bottom. And I know that we have some lunch and learns coming up where we can visit some of the vintage cooperatives. Really excited about that one. And then I think in the summer, there's one at Morningstar too. So um, think about those upcoming events. But this is where you can find all of that affiliate information, their logo, the contact information, phone number, website, email address, and then the member savings that you get for being a member as well. So all of that is here and it's been updated um, in January of this year. So new affiliates have been added. I think our newest affiliates are Medigold, Concept by Iowa Hearing, and then AAA Movers. So we've got some new ones in there. All this information is updated and it will keep being updated as you know, if new affiliates are added. So you don't have to worry that this will be behind. We will keep up on that and make sure all that information is there for you as it comes. Okay, scrolling up here again. And if you know of anybody that wants to become an affiliate, oh, of course I clicked again. It's just gonna take me back to the same page. The become affiliate area is if someone wants to become an affiliate, it's just gonna list the, um, the three levels, supporter, champion, executive, what they get with that membership. And then it's loading here as I'm scrolling the area for application. So again, if you know anybody that wants to be a Seniors in the Move affiliate, they can sign up through our website very easily. And then, all right, we get into my next two favorite pages. We're gonna to go to the testimonials page. And this is new, this wasn't on the old website. And I really like it because you get to see videos of testimonials. You can see 
um, you know, text testimonials. And it's just a great way to know that Seniors in the Move is helping, what people are really enjoying about it. So I see Miss Nancy here. We've got a nice uh, testimonial on the top. And then I think most of you have seen this general video about Seniors in the Move. This is the best one probably to share with others to just want a general overview about, um, you know, who we are and what we do. But I will go ahead and play this one. Is that all right for one that I can play? This is my first trip with Seniors on the Move. Um, first trip kind of overnight for the group and feel really safe. Everybody's masked and we've had a uh, really good time. Stayed in a beautiful hotel in Galena, the DeSoto Hotel. A lot of history, time to shop. It was a fun day and now we're in Dubuque up on the bluffs and um, it's just a real great way to travel. We're having a lot of fun and uh, Looking forward to the next one. I love that music in the background. <laughs> um, so I've got a couple other testimonials here. Uh, that one is from a first time day tripper attendee. And then we've got some familiar faces here. Is Carol and Nikki in the webinar today at all? No, neither of them are. I'm gonna go ahead and play Carol's. Uh, I, I think this one was from last year's March Lunch and Learn. At a TiVo Trail. Mm -hmm. Yeah, at a TiVo Trail in that really nice area with the fireplace. Hi, my name is Carol Holter. One of my favorite trips, I've taken a lot of them and they're all fun, but the one that I remember the most is uh, the carousel in Story City. We had so much fun riding around and around and just laughing and having a good time. We've, I've met several friends. One actually is from my hometown that we got together and several other friends and then I have a, had a friend that joined also. All right, so uh, yeah, just another nice message from a member Carol. And then we've got one from Nikki down here as well. I won't play all of them, um, but what I do want to say is that if any of you have you know, a personal moment on a trip that you really enjoyed and you'd like to talk about it to be in one of these videos, or maybe you just have some text like up here at the top about an enjoyable time that you had, I'd love to hear it. I'd love to, you know, we'd all love to add more to this page. Um, it's a good thing to share with people that are thinking about joining. So if you have a time, um, you know, that really stuck with you on a trip or a way that Seniors in the Move really helped, please don't hesitate to reach out to any of us. Again, our email addresses are on that staff page under the About Us there, um, or give us a call and let us know. I'd love to hear more testimonials. And then let's see, photo gallery here. This is another new page. And another great one to share with others. So um, similar to like the other photos that were on the other pages, the way that you can navigate through these pictures is the scroll bar at the bottom. You can drag it across, see all those smiling faces. Maybe you're in some of these photos. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and click on this first one here. This one I think is my favorite. So we're gonna click on this one. This was from our zoo trip over the summer. What a hot day. Oh, and here's the cat that I mentioned before. He's coming to say hello, everybody. Um, just a great picture. I thought it was really nice. What a fun trip. And then again, you can click on these arrows on the right and on the left to go through, and then the X will take you out of it. So if you want to view these wonderful photos from some of the day trip or tours. Uh, that was a hot day, but didn't we have someone that rode a camel? <laughs> yes, yeah, we did. Let me see if that's on here. I think it is. Hey, I just saw it. It's, it was Carol. Wow. Yeah, here we go. There she is. Yeah. <laughs> I just remember how hot it was and how nice it was to ride on the train. 
because then you could get some air circulating. So. Right. And it was a day last year when it was, you know, we were just trying to think of things to do where we didn't have to wear masks and we could gather. And so that was very challenging. Um, so we started with a few outdoor uh, trips. And so these weren't things that were planned before. They were just kind of like in place of and trying to be flexible and, and bob and weave with our situation last summer. <laughs> But it was really a lot of fun. We couldn't plan the weather, of course. Um, and, you know, we couldn't plan the transportation that we lost. I thought we didn't have our trolleys at the last yeah, minute. We had to take right limos. Limo. Yeah. And um, so that was like a last minute thing that happened in 30 minutes. But we made it work. And it was 100 degrees. And we had Velma Chestnut celebrating with her tiara her 100th mm -hmm. birthday so it was 100 degrees and we celebrated at 100th birthday and she was a trooper let me tell you that was a fun day so yeah take a look through these photos you might find yourself there's miss velma right there in her in her tiara 100 years that was a fun celebration okay so i'm going to scroll down the page here and this is a video about that zoo trip um, and then we'll see pictures from senior retreat day last year. Again, you can scroll and flip through. Here's some familiar faces, Kim and Nancy right there. Um, the video we watched earlier for senior retreat day that lives here as well. And then pictures from lunch and learns and other events. A lot of these photos are from the last tech workshop that we did that was at Heartland, um, Heartland Retirement, correct? Yes. And we'll see, here's Miss Nancy announcing this year's trips. You have to keep pointing me out. I know. <laughs> it's because everyone recognizes you. They know your smiling face. So yeah, you might find some, uh, some nice pictures of yourself tucked away in here. But again, a nice way to just kind of look back on things that have happened or a good way to show people um, that may not have you mean the art members or haven't experienced anything with us before. And then do you mind if I play this zoo video? Go ahead. Okay. feel like I'm in a jungle. I'm trying to plug in my computer and my cat's making another appearance here. Excuse me. Excuse me. Very good. I saw that Carol just popped on and we were just showing a picture of Carol and her uh, giraffe debut. Camel. <laughs> her, oh, her camel. Yeah. Did she wasn't writing a giraffe. I would like to ride a giraffe. But, yeah. yeah. There she is waving. <laughs> All yeah. right. So I think... Oh, well, I can just go to this little contact tab here. It's mostly information I think everybody will know. But if you want to get in contact with us, you need to know our address, phone number, things like that. That's where you find all this information. And then our social media links. So, And when our address does change, we, because yeah. um, as most of you know, our the building where we were renting office space was taken back by the city of West Des Moines. So we lost that the end of last summer and then of course you know pandemic and shutdowns on top of that so we didn't really uh, move into a new space and we've been working virtually um nancy and i have and uh, just have some things stored for now but i am um currently looking for a new office space so we will have a, a physical um address hopefully soon in the next few months and that's where you'll find it awesome all right, well, I think that's all of my presentation part. So I will stop sharing my screen. Okay, and, and I will- Back over to Kim. I will attempt to share mine. Perfect. Okay, can everybody see my screen?
Yes. They're like, we don't know if it's your screen. Is it your screen? <laughs> okay, so we went through the photo gallery and the contact information. So now I'm gonna go through the events calendar. Let me get rid of my thumbnail here. So I think uh, you will see that this is where all of our events live. So uh, upcoming events, um, some of these are not upcoming events that are sponsored by Seniors on the Move, but they are sponsored by our affiliates. So for the Metagold, you can see that this one appears because it has a range. So they have um, different virtual seminars going on through March 30th. And you can find more details, not register, but you can find more details about that um, when you click there. And this is going kind of slow, but same with the fitness calendar. Uh, this says January, it should say February. There we go. It looks like I need to change that, but there is the February calendar that is attached there. Um, this was the event today, website navigation. And um, when you want to register for an event, you can do it from this page. Um, you can also, whoops, uh oh, what, what did I do? Okay. Um, you can also look at it in calendar view. So if you look up at the top right hand, Part of your screen, you can change the view to calendar view. And here you'll see that it'll go through and um, some of these things that are ongoing, it will just show that they're straight through. If it's something like this, you will see that you can click right on to the event and it should take you to the event where you can register. So you can look at it in you know, a couple different ways. Um, this is the add to my calendar link. So say I wanted to add it to my calendar, I would click here and it would say, okay, is your calendar a Google calendar, a Outlook calendar, um, Apple calendar, and it would automatically put this event onto your calendar so that you would not forget it and you wouldn't have to do it manually. Okay, now I'm just gonna go back this way. Another thing, what, what's going on? Okay. So I wanna switch back to list view. Um, oh, download the trip brochure. This is actually a place where you can download the brochure for day trippers. If you wanna download that um, overarching um, brochure that we put out that shows the 2021 itinerary. Um, let's say that you are wanting to register for ooh, French Riviera, uh, the presentation. But let's do something that actually has a price. Let's say we want to go um, on the Celebration Bell cruise. This tells you here the date, the time, you can show details here, or you can register right from here. It tells me that there are 25 spaces left. If I wanna see the details, they are all there. Again, I can add this to my calendar if I want to. Um, you can download the registration form if you uh, feel like you would rather um, fill it out on paper, send in a check. You can do that, you're very welcome to do that. Um, this is also the place where you can download the emergency contact form. Um, if you have that all filled out ahead of time, we do like to uh, keep those obviously with us just in case on the bus. So we do require that everyone has one. If you don't have one when you get on the bus, then we will give you one on a clipboard and ask you to fill that out. Um, if you've traveled with us in the past, we will pull your form and we'll have one already. Uh, so if you already have one on file, um, unless we ask you to update it, uh, you probably won't need to do this. Over here, you can see the prices. Um, I have gone in as a non-member. Um, I'm going in as uh, Mark today. And so it's telling me that I can't get the Day Tripper Club or the member pricing because um, that's why it's grayed out because I'm a non-member. 
But if I want to register, I can register. And now it's, um, it's saying, oh, are you uh, somebody that's been in contact with us before? Um, I'm going to say, I'm Mark. And actually Mark has done some things with us before. Um, so it's telling me now here, it's telling Mark that uh, some of these registration types are only available to members. So um, if I wanted to apply for membership, I could do so right here. And then it's also saying, um, hey, you're already in our database and you may have some information that's in your online account. Um, if you wanna do that, then you can go ahead and log in. So this is where we log in to our online accounts. Uh, so whether you're a member or um, that you have signed up uh, to subscribe for a newsletter or you've traveled with us before or come to an event before, you can have an online account. You don't have to be a paid member to do that. Let's make sure this says Mark and not Kim. Okay. Now I have to remember Mark's password and log in. Okay, you don't wanna save that, but as you can see now, if you look up here where the little person is, it should say that I'm Mark. And it does say that I'm Mark Poole, and unfortunately I'm not. Um, and unfortunately he's not here, but uh, Mark Poole now is going to uh, register for Hits of the Decades. Um, I guess we can just go in and view his profile. I'll show you through these different things. Here's the profile. So if you are in your online account, you can go to my profile. If you need to edit that, you can go to the edit profile button. And these are the things that you can edit. So you could edit your address, if you have a new address, a new phone number, that type of thing. Um, date of birth is something that's not required, but it is required. We do like to have that just for statistics. And we also um, will need that if you are going to take advantage of one of our plans for Delta Dental or Delta Vision. Email subscriptions is something that um, Katie talked about a while ago. And this is where you would see what you're subscribed to. My event registrations, we haven't registered yet. It's telling us it's in progress. So we haven't registered yet for hits of the decades, but we will. But this shows that we registered for today's event and that that was confirmed. Um, we have also uh, registered, this is showing us that we've registered for the April Lunch and Learn as a non-member. And so it's been invoiced, but not paid. Um, and then down here, you'll see this little button that says um, you have a balance due here. So I could click here and go ahead and take care of that balance in complete registration for Celebration Bell. So that would tell me to go ahead and complete that registration. So I can do it from any of those prompts. I can also go up here where there's this little warning sign that says, hey, you might have uh, an invoice that's due. And this does say, yes, you have an invoice due. Um, so if I wanted to pay this online, I could go ahead and say, oh, pay online. And it goes to the credit card information. So here's where I would put my credit card information, um, the expiration date, the three digit number, or if it's an American Express, it would be a four digit. Um, secret number there, code, CVV code. Uh, billing address is always needed, phone number. Um, and down here, if you'd like, and this is something that can only be done from your personal account. It's not something that Nancy or I can do when we are signing you up on our admin site. Um, but if you're going into your site, you can actually store your credit card for faster checkout later. Um, so it is, is totally secure and it's also, but it's something that Nancy and I cannot do. We could help walk you through it, but that's something that has to be done through your online account. 
I'm going to back up here because I don't really want to pay for Mark there. Okay. Um, donations, we're not really doing anything there. That's just a, a standard button. Here, the event registration is in progress. To continue my registration, I would just click continue. And again, it's telling me I could get a, a better price if I applied for membership. But since I didn't, then I would go ahead then and register as a non-member, put in my information. If I wanted to add a guest, I could add a guest. And it's telling me that each of my guests would be the same price because it's assuming that the guest is not uh, a member as well. Um, so sometimes uh, there are members who want to bring non-members and then we might have to go back in on the back end and change the system so it that it does calculate the correct price um, because it doesn't give me the opportunity to program that in to do an option. Um, we do like to know right now we have the two main um, spots for pickup are Walmart and Windsor Heights and uh, Bonanza on Northeast 14th. So we like to know which one that you would be picked up at. Um, sometimes if we have enough people to justify picking up at another location, we will do that. So we've done that in the past at some certain um, senior living communities where we had more than 10 people. Okay, so that is a little bit about the events calendar, a little bit about your profile. Um, if you want to change your password, you can do it from here. So it's gonna ask you what's your current password, what's your new password, confirm it and save it. And that's real simple to do. Um, if you ever forget your current password and you can't even get into the system at all, just let me know because then I can email a link to you that will automatically give you a password reset. So that's something that I can do on my end. So, um, and then you can log out. And that is that. Okay, are there any questions? Don't hear anything. Kim? Yes. Now I hear something. This is Mary Marshall. Is the French Riviera trip still on? Um, no, everybody, the, the French Riviera trip has been um, postponed to next April. So I, I think that um, you and Susan uh, did, you know, confirm that you were possibly interested in that, but nobody has registered yet for next year's French Riviera. Um, and anybody that was registered for this year's uh, trip, which was postponed, um, was notified. Mm -hmm. Okay, I and want to make sure it was still possible. Oh, yes. And there is um, here, uh, let me go back to the events. There is going to be a presentation and we've done one in the past, but we're going to do this again. In my screen, it's in April. So here you can see there's a spotlight on the French Riviera virtual presentation. So this will be a Zoom presentation that you can sign up for. And the link will be right here. It's at six o'clock uh, in the evening on Tuesday, April 27th. And our representative, Amanda McCarthy from uh, Colette, this is a, a Colette partnership here, uh, will be presenting the French Riviera. So she'll be showing us all the things that um, are going to be planned for the trip um, and all of the details. Any other questions for me or for Katie? I just have a comment, <clears throat> Nancy here, and I just want to say thank you, Katie and Kim. You know, the this thing takes tons of hours. I'm very aware of that, and it is looks like it's very user friendly for those of us who need user friendly, and and that's wonderful. And and I love, I love your enthusiasm, Katie. <laughs> Yeah, thank you so much. You know, this is a this is a great website. You know, I'm very excited about its looks, appearance, and 
hopefully everybody will really be excited as well. I can see how your faces are so excited. They are. Look at them all. And yes. And again, if you have any questions offline that you want to ask us, you can actually do that right from the website. Come up here, look at the staff and the staff page will show you all the people that you can contact. And we will have a new one that's going to fill this space very soon. And we'll keep that a surprise. <laughs> Um, and you can just click here and actually, I mean, you can always call us, but you can actually go ahead and email us as well. So if you just click on the email, then that would take you straight to an email. It's taking me to a very strange email address that I never use anymore. <laughs> It'll open it on whatever mail application you have on the device you're using. So since you're on like your desktop computer, It'll probably open it up in the your desktop mail, which is why. Yeah, well, that's not, no, I don't ever use this and I only have a laptop. So we're just gonna get rid of that. But you I know, will, either way. I will say about, um, if you wanna navigate the website on your smartphone, for some reason, I'm having a hard time getting it to appear the correct way on your phone. Um, so if you go to it on your phone um, and you're browsing on your phone that way, it might look a little bit different. And my apologies about that. I'd like to be able to fix it. Um, but if you're on a computer or on a tablet, it should look the same way. Um, and everything we just went through should be the same. So don't be surprised if, if you're on your phone and it looks a little bit different. It is something I'd love to fix. But uh, yeah, as much as I know about websites and designing things, that that's a little bit uh, something I'm still learning about. So be patient with that. And if it looks different, that is why. This is Margie. Kim, I'd like to thank you and Katie for all the work that you've done and helping us get into the 21st century so we can kind of communicate a little bit better. I think I can do this better now. Thank you so much. Great. Yep. If you need any more help, just let us know. All right. Well, if there aren't any more questions, um, I will go ahead and end the meeting. We will have this um, posted online. Katie will go in and kind of edit out the first part where we were waiting for people to pop in, uh, make it more concise, and then she will um, put it out there probably in a Facebook link and also on the website so you can access it again. Um, lots of times I would send the recording back out to the people that attended um, but in this case, I'll probably just go ahead and let you do that. And maybe I'll just send out a notice that this is where you can find it if you want to um, revisit what we've talked about today. All right. So thank you, everyone, and have a great day. Um, it looks sunshiny outside. And uh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Hugs, everyone. <laughs> <laughs>